Number 52. What is the value of the equilibrium constant at 500 degrees Celsius for the formation of NH3 according to the following equation? And then they give us this equation right here. So they say that an equilibrium mixture of the NH3 gas, H2 gas, and N2 gas at 500 degrees Celsius were found to contain 1.35 molar H2, 1.15 molar N2, and a 4.12 times 10 to the negative 1 molar NH3 concentrations. Okie dokie. So we need to find out what that equilibrium constant is. And remember, the equilibrium constant is a K value. And in this case, they gave us molarities. So I'm looking for a KC value. C stands for concentration, aka molarities. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to rewrite this formula a little bit bigger. So I got N2, that's a gas, plus 3H2, gas. And this comes to equilibrium with 2 NH3 gas. Okay, now I'm going to write down all the information that they gave me. Well, they told me that I had 1.35 molar of N2. They told me that I had, ooh, just kidding. Did anybody catch that? This goes over here, 1.35 molar for H2. They tricked me. 1.15 molar for the N2 and then 4.12 times 10 to the negative first uh, molar concentration of NH3. Now, this is super important. Make sure, or not make sure, but just state what these are. They said that these were already the concentrations at equilibrium. So I'm just gonna put, these are equilibrium values. Now it may not be a lot right now, but once we get into more complicated uh, equilibrium calculations, this is going to matter. So now remember, in order to find a KC, there's only one formula. It's that products divided by reactants formula. It's this one right here. So I'm just going to put this over here. And we just need to make a specific one for this case. Remember, products divided by reactants, only aqueous and gases are allowed. These are all gases, so we're good. Let's write out that KC formula. KC equals something divided by something else, products, looks like I have the NH3, close that bracket, and now raise to the coefficients, right, COEF is just short for coefficients, there was a 2 in front of here, so I'm just going to square this, and then we got, let's see, our N2, close up that bracket, that's raised to the first, there was nothing in front of here, so I could just keep moving on. These are multiplied by each other in the KC formula. So I have H2, close that up. This is raised to the third, so I'm just going to put a three here. The coefficient was a three, so I'm going to raise it to the third. Now, only equilibrium values are allowed in this equation. No initial values and no change, just equilibrium. That's why it's super important to just know what are these values. Since these were at equilibrium, I could take all these numbers and plug them in. Simple as that. Kc equals, let's see, we got the uh, 4.12. I should have made this red. I'm just, I just like to look at it. So I'm just going to say 4.12 times 10 to the negative 1, molarity, and then I'll just put 4.12 times 10 to the negative 1. I won't put the units because I know that they're the correct units. Only molarity is allowed to be in here when you're doing KC. And then I got, let's see, 1.15, close that up. And then I got 1.35, and that's going to be raised to the third. Okay. So, if you want, we could just get one number on the top, one number on the bottom, and maybe I can pull this a little bit to this side just so that I have a little bit more room. Let's just pull this over. Okay. So, 4.12 times 10 to the negative first, raised to the second, I get a big, big, big number. Actually, a small number, but a lot of, a lot of uh, decimals. So 169744, 
And then let's see what the bottom gets me. I'm going to do 1.35 cubed and then times that by 1.15. This one I'm going to cut off after some decimals, 2.829, you know, uh, 4, 3. And now all I got to do is just divide, which I will put the answer up here. So, the where is that first answer? It is right here, divided by 2.82943. And I get... If we're rounding, let's see, three sig figs all around, so 0, 0.0, actually, we're going to have to round it, six, 0, 0.0, 600, 0, 0. right? Yep, one, two, three, that's the next nine, round it up, it's a six. So you could either say it as this, or you could say six times 10 to the negative one, two. But either one is fine with me. And just remember, KC has no units, so this is unit less. And there you go. That was fun, guys. Hopefully this helped. Let me know in the comments. Thank you so much for viewing the video. Let's keep rocking and rolling, and I will see you all in the next lesson. And if you want, please press the subscribe. That will help us. And thank you for that. See you later. Bye-bye.